briefcase, briefs, and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In 2016, the Supreme Court of the United States ruled in the case of Campbell Uwald Company v. Gomez, which revolved around a dispute between the Navy and marketing company Campbell Uwald, who sent text message marketing to young adults, including the plaintiff, Jose Gomez. Gomez sued Campbell Ewald for violating the Telephone Consumer Protection Act, TCPA, by sending unwanted messages. Initially, the lower court ruled in favor of Campbell Ewald, but an appeals court reversed the decision. The Supreme Court considered whether an unaccepted settlement offer from the company made the case moot, and if the company had sovereign immunity as a government contractor. The court held that an unaccepted settlement offer does not render a case moot, nor does the company have sovereign immunity. Consequently, the case proceeded. The court also decided that companies could not claim derivative sovereign immunity. A defendant's offer to pay damages did not automatically make a case moot, and a company could be held vicariously liable for others' actions if involved in wrongdoing. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.